welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today I have a what's in my kids Easter basket. So this year unfortunately I wasn't really able to go out shopping and buy them all the things that I usually buy them or as much as I usually buy them because just like everyone else I did not think this whole virus thing would have gotten so out of control where we would have been self-quarantined. Wasn't really thinking about that so I did already have a few things on hand because I am that person that buys little things here and there way in advance and holds on to it if I find like a really good deal. So thankfully I did have a few things already on hand and then a few days ago when I did my grocery pickup, um, honey, when I did my grocery pickup, I was able to put some things in the cart for the drive up. So I do have a few things. It's not a lot. So this is going to be a really short what's in my kids Easter basket. But honestly, I'm not complaining. I'm usually that parent that goes overboard and then we're stuck with a bunch of junk. So I guess, <laughs> so I guess, um, this actually works out because now my kids aren't going to be stuck with a bunch of stuff. They still will be getting something for Easter. So I know they'll enjoy it and be grateful for the few things that I do already have for them. So I'm going to start off with, I guess, like the edible stuff, like candy. I only bought them two things. Okay, so the first two things are going to be these chocolate bunnies. And they are chocolate crispy bunnies. So each of them will be getting one of these. So every year I usually like to stuff the kids' eggs myself. But this year I wasn't able to buy like a bunch of stuffers for the eggs. So when I did my grocery order I saw this and it's just how many eggs it comes with 12 eggs and they are pre-stuffed and it comes with a bunch of different candy it's all chocolate so they each will be getting six of these pre-stuffed um eggs like I said it's all chocolate it's Reese's Cadbury mini eggs Robin eggs and Hershey Kisses so they all be getting six of those each and that's the only like candy stuff that I got for them so next it's going to be these little woodsies bobbles and I found these at Target a while back and they were on clearance for a dollar 48 so Ryan will be getting one and then Madison will be getting one as well. Also, I do apologize about this lighting. I'm using the natural light, the sun, and it keeps on coming in and out. So I apologize about Madison in the background and hopefully you guys don't hear my husband sawing in the back because he's currently doing some yard work. But anyways, um, I also got this a while back from Target and this is on clearance for only $2.98. It's a pack of two. These are like water guns you can use um, in the pool or if you just play with the kids outside and you have like a big bucket of water or something, they can play with it. So it's perfect, comes with two. So one for Ryan, one for Madison. So I'm gonna put that in their Easter basket as well. They each will be getting a bubble wand. So the blue one is for Ryan and then this pink one is for Madison and they are the Peeps brand. This is also something I got up from my drive up grocery order. I saw these and I thought they were really cute and I don't think it's scented. I think it's just the Peeps brand, but I just thought that was really cute. Next is going to be these water paints. So I love these water paints because you don't need actual paint. There is little paint squares in the bottom already. So they just wet their little paintbrush and then they can paint the pictures. So I got two, one for Ryan, one for Madison. Since Ryan loves dinosaurs, he's going to get the dinosaur one. And then since um, Madison really doesn't care, I just got her this little monster one. So they're each are going to get one of these. Grabbed them this, I think from Target Dollar Spot. Yeah, these were from the Target Dollar Spot. They were each a dollar. So I got Ryan. The blue one is just a wooden bunny with paint in the bottom. And then this one is a purple wooden bunny. And then it also has the paint in the back with a paintbrush. So this lighting is not letting you guys see it really well, but that's how it looks. And they were only a dollar each. And then for Ryan, he loves to read. He especially loves Dr. Seuss books. So I found this one also for my grocery pickup um, and they were on sale for $6. I probably should have gotten more just because he loves to read. He's gone through all his books already, but I got this one. It's the Dr. Seuss book of animals. He loves animals. So I thought that would be really cute to put in his socket as well. Uh, maybe I'll buy one for Madison. I just never buy books for Madison because she's not into books. She rips out the pages and stuff. And a lot of times I try to read to her and she won't sit still. So maybe if I find a Peppa Pig one, maybe I'll get her the Peppa Pig one. She might sit still for that. But I just got one for Ryan. It was only $6. I also got them these bouncing balls. I thought these looked really cool. So you pretty much make your own bounce ball. And I got two packs and it comes with a, three different colors in each one. It says easy to make. It has the directions in the back. So one pack each for the kids. And then the last thing I got for the kids were stuffed animals. They both really love stuffed animals, especially Ryan. So I got Ryan this brown one. 
and then I got Madison this little pink unicorn one. So these are the last two things they will both be getting in their Easter basket this year. All right, you guys, so that is going to end my What's in My Kids Easter basket this year. Like I said, very small little haul just because I cannot go out to the store and actually shop for them. So a few of these things, like I said, I did do in my instant cart when I did my drive up order for groceries. And the rest are things that I already had on hand that I previously bought a few months ago that I was still holding on to specifically for Easter. So like I said, although it's not a lot of stuff, they are still going to be grateful and they'll still be getting something for Easter. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you haven't already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. As always, thanks so much for watching. I love you guys and I will see you guys next time. Bye.